Welcome back LHS, I'm Carly Wright and today is Wednesday, February 23rd and this is your Blue Devil News. some really important dates, LHS, so listen up. March 1st is the national deadline for graduating seniors to submit their FAFSA. March 1st is also the school-wide ACT for students in grades 9 through 11. Juniors are taking the ACT. 9th and 10th graders are taking practice tests that will be used to determine some students' placements on next year's schedule. After March 5th, the yearbook prices will increase to $90. And last but not least, spring break is March 7th through 11th. Seniors, your senior fee is $75 and is due by March 1st. You can pay at the bank or online. If this is your first time using School Cash Online, you will have to register before you can use the app. You can also submit your height, weight, and the correct spelling of your first, middle, and last name by scanning this QR code or going to the link below. Seniors, if you are interested in performing at Senior Night, see Ms. Fitzgerald in the choir room, A704, and pick up a form. Auditions will be on Wednesday, March 2nd in the choir room. Truancy letters for driver's permit slash license must be requested 24 hours in advance from attendance office, room A100. Prom will be held on April 29th at the mill for juniors and seniors. Tickets are on sale at the bank and online. Tickets are $55 each until February 28th. Beginning in March, tickets will be $65 each and $75 each in April. Take advantage of the discounted rate and buy your tickets now. We will be right back after these segments. Thank 
The season for Blue Devil Swimming has come to an end, and I have some news for you on that. I'm Erson Scott, and this is your School Sports News. As of two weekends ago, the 2021-2022 to high school swim season has come to an end. The final swimming tournament was held at the Tiska Championships in Nashville. The two seniors there representing Lebanon High were Emma Perucki and Walter Ork. Perucki participated in the 200 freestyle and the 100 breaststroke. Ork, on the other hand, participated in, two, in the 200 individual medley and the 100 backstroke. Both of these students did amazing in their individual competitions. Ork even set a personal best for himself in the preliminary swimming, which, if you don't know, is the portion before the competition which determines swimmers that will be able to participate in competitions. So congratulations, Walter and Emma. Besides just Walter's accomplishments in the finals, the whole team has had a good year this year. 44 personal best times were set in the swimming season this year, with an additional 47 regional qualifying swims and 74 top five finishes. It really was an awesome year for the Blue Devil swimming team. Congratulations, and we hope to see you all back out in the pool next season. Any girls interested in playing soccer next year, please stop by A103 and sign up. There will be a brief information meeting next Thursday after school in A103. We look forward to seeing you. Our Devilettes played against Mount Juliet this Monday and took home the win with a final score of 55-22. to Our senior players scored a combined total of 41 points. Senior guard Terry Reynolds led the Devilettes with 15 points, 3 rebounds, and 4 steals. Senior post Mayoshi Mason ended the night with a double-double, scoring 12 points and snatching 10 rebounds. Senior guard Asia Barr had 10 points, and senior post Nalaya Rankins ended the night with 4 points and 11 rebounds. The Devilettes went on a 32-0 run against the Lady Bears to steal the win. This Friday night at 7 p.m., the Devilettes will face off against their old district rival, Beach High School. This game will be the first elimination round of the regional tournament. The boys' ba basketball team got out to a quick start with a 19-0 run to begin the game and went on to defeat the Cookville Cavaliers 71-63 in the district 9-4A championship game. Junior, junior Jared Hall led the Blue Devils with 21 points, followed by Yurin Alexander with 18 and Wyatt Bowling with 11. Alexander and Bowling were both named to the all-tournament team and Hall was selected as tournament MVP. Thank you to all of the students, teachers, administrators that came out and were part of the big Lebanon crowd last night. The Blue Devils will be back in action on Saturday night at 7 p.m. at home against Hunters Lane in the first round of the region tournament. Well, that's all. I'm Erson Scott, and this has been your School Sports News. Chamber Choir and Sapphire Women's Choir performed at the MTVA Regional Choir Festival on Wednesday. Chamber Choir earned a rating of Superior and will advance to the ACDA State Choir Festival in April. Sapphire earned a rating of Excellent and with a fantastic performance. Congratulations, everyone. The National Honor Society will be collecting pop tabs until February 28th to support the Ronald McDonald House. If you have any pop tabs from a Kickstart, give them to an NHS member. Criminal Justice will be selling hoodies and crew sweatshirts at the bank until Friday, February 25th. The hoodie is $25, the crew neck is $20, and it's $2 more if you get a 2XL or higher. Order yours today. French Club has a meeting today after school in B306. Cafe Blue now serves breakfast on Thursdays and Fridays from 7.25 to 10 a.m. Students may come before school and between classes only. Teachers can order online from the Cafe Blue link. That's all the news we have today, LHS. I'm Carly, and this has been news to you from the White House.